Hello everyone. Uh, I wish everyone a, a fruitful conference. Uh, this is uh, Professor Sutku Mezar from Istanbul, Istanbul uh, Commerce University. Uh, my presentation will be about uh, assessment of future uh, for metaverse tokens. Metaverse is a uh, ecosystem where people people can live a second life maybe in a virtual world. Uh, we have uh, written this uh, paper with my friend Gülşah uh, Gencer Çelik from Beykent University. Uh, she's an assistant professor. And uh, as all you know, the crypto world has been is expanding and developing throughout the world and the tokens and coins of this crypto world are of high demand and uh, our objective in this uh, study is to study a significant field within the crypto world which are metaverse tokens in order to live a second life in a virtual life we have to spend money again but those monies are not the crypto are not the currencies we use in real life uh, each ecosystem uh, produces its own tokens and depending on the demand for those tokens they are valued in a market usually in exchanges and we had actually two different objectives one of them was uh, to assess the future of these uh, tokens metaverse world in another words and also uh, how are those tokens since returns are affected are they affected from each other okay we try to do, we try to put uh, forth uh, evidence uh, for their uh, influencing factors metaverse play to earn and non-fungible tokens are the recent and innovations in the crypto world and they are of interest for uh, many parties uh, including people use them they spend those tokens investors also buy those tokens even though they don't use them in the play they don't play the game but they believe there will be a high demand for those games and the token will gain value and also regulators are interested in these tokens because somehow they are not taxed and maybe they should be taxable etc some countries uh, elect uh, to ban them some of them uh, elect to use them as a functional currency like El Salvador uh, despite the concerns for this crypto space in general its dimensions are expanding day by day platforms provide tokens for its users and our objective was as I have mentioned to understand the structure of these returns in these tokens we believe that investors may have hardship to differentiate among them because there are more than one uh, ecosystem. We will see them. Uh, in this study, we have uh, selected the biggest top five metaverse tokens, depending on the uh, volume, trading volume. And investors rush to the other one as they cannot read the differences among them. So this is kind of an exp uh, expeditionary study again. Some kind of a spillover effect is sought in these coins as well. Uh, how can we define a metaverse? A metaverse is a virtual space where users can enjoy various activities and share uh, experiences. Uh, platforms, there are many, first of all, but the top ones are Decentraland, Sandbanks or OVR. They enable investors to possess like uh, apartment buildings, land. Uh, they have divided the world into parcels. For example, in decentralized, uh, where mana currency is used, there are 90,601 lands. You can buy with your real uh, currencies a land, for example, in your downtown. But the problem is, there is no, in the world, in real life, there is only one title deed for your downtown, the center, Times Square. Okay, But the problem with this crypto world, there are 
other ecosystems like sandbox they have divided the world into 166,464 lands and you can buy the same location but in another ecosystem so the difference in the crypto world you can duplicate the title dates so the investors have to find which ecosystem will survive in the future which one will bring in money okay so these uh, ecosystems uh, uh, should be taught uh, in terms of accessibility diversity equi equality and humanity uh, architecture uh, a, a three layer one is proposed uh, and layers are composed of infrastructure layer layer there should be an operating system for the ecosystem to survive interaction layer layer where users experience takes place and finally the ecosystems where artificial intelligence may make make life easier for the users are the components of the uh, infrastructure architecture uh, for the future extended reality is important uh, extended real uh, reality will uh, help users to live in their second life as if they are in the real world a mirror world will be created in order for a metaverse to be viable realis realism is needed and this can be achieved if extended reality extends further ubiquity interop interoperability and scalability may be other components uh, regarding with the market in the cryptocurrency market we have discussed about engine is a another economist is a token used for virtual game industry and it is ethereum based mana uh, backed by facebook that's the central land is the ecosystem's name another token it's again backed by ethereum mana denominated virtual lands are traded or rented by real investors sandbox is another play to earn project such as access infinity uh, that enable users to create their own characters to trade crypto assets and the metaverse market is estimated to be worth 814 billion dollars by 2028 this is a huge number okay and uh, we thought this is worth studying and our data composed of 394 daily observations between 2020 December to uh, January 2022 uh, we have uh, selected five uh, cryptocurrencies uh, mana engine theta access and sandbox sand but we also wanted to see the relation of these metaverse tokens with Bitcoin and Ethereum so we have uh, added them to our list uh, we also looked at their trading volumes our findings regarding with mana returns decentralized uh, change in engine returns competitive competitor token are positively related with changes in mana with 99 percent statistical significance the rest are insignificant as you can see in this table so engine returns explain the change in mana returns in our uh, Nivi West uh, regression regarding with uh, engine returns they are affected positively by mana theta access and ethereum returns 99 percent significant their returns are interestingly negatively influenced by its own trading value volume so when the trading volume of engine increases the returns decreases so uh, this is an interesting finding and as you can see this uh, in our table engine returns for um, theta returns uh, they are positively affected by bit, uh, bitcoin and engine returns at 99 percent for mana the significance is at 95 percent for x it is at 90 percent Striking, strikingly theta returns has the highest positive correlation with bitcoin trading volume the only one in our study in our sample 
Theta deviates from other tokens as it is the only asset that has been influenced by the trading volume of the leading coins. As you can see, the theta returns. So it's affected positively by Bitcoin returns uh, and Bitcoin volume. Uh, this is the only one in our study. For X, uh, engine returns explain the changes uh, positively. Uh, for in the table we see that theta returns, ethereum returns and constant have positive relationship with X token and BTC return has a positive but merely insignificant uh, effect on this token as you can see in this table as well. Um, to conclude and to be short and precise not to take your time, uh, despite the concerns with the virtual world Investors are channeling their funds to metaverses uh, in terms of non-fungible tokens or parcels in particular metaverses ecosystem. Uh, games are game industry is expanding, growing, so play to earn tokens enable users to trade their assets by using metaverse tokens and demand for these tokens depend on the success of the game or the metaverse in terms of popularity. Our results indicate that these tokens are positively influenced from their rivals returns. This results may indicate that investors see them as a cluster for investment and they may not know how to defer them yet. Uh, Bitcoin volume is found to be effective on Theta only and Ethereum volume is found to have almost no effect on these token returns which is interesting. Uh, we didn't expect that once we start studying and analyzing. The prospects for metaverse tokens are bright. Digital life may uh, sound mundane to the majority, but businesses, colle colleagues, and various industries will enjoy not paying rent to physical buildings, and they will be able to serve their customer in a similar fashion with the real world. The question should not uh, be about the presence of metaverse ecosystems. Uh, in the future, but which ones will survive, which ones will prevail matters for the tokens of this world is the main question that an investors should uh, find an answer to. So we believe in the future of these metaverse tokens, but uh, investors has to be selective. Uh, many thanks for listening and giving me the opportunity to discuss the matters. I would like to receive uh, questions if you have any you can find me at ssmezar at tijaret edutr i thank to i thank again for the organizers as well thank you